starting in just about five minutes time but we've got a chance now to look back on the best of the compulsory dances this is the world champions isabel delabelle and olivier schoenfelder simon reed alongside chris howarth to take you through this the compulsory dance here just one compulsory dance in the grand prix the paso doble and it's a perfect choice for these two Delabelle and Schoenfelder, the best of the best. That was the routine that took them to the top of the pile in the compulsory dances today. You'll see the original program and the free dance in the next couple of days. But Delabelle and Schoenfelder, the champions last year, the world champions, runners-up in the European Championships. Well, they really put the others to the sword. Super performance. Muriel Zazoui, who coaches them in Lyon, has taken them. Well, I mean, year before last, they were out of the medals, and suddenly this year they came and won the world championship. Yeah, absolutely, a, a renewed confidence from these two, and you can see through that compulsory dance. It's it's not one of the hardest compulsory dances to perform, but to to skate it at that speed and generate so much speed and still look that smooth and sophisticated absolutely brilliant and now they have the aura of being world champions they do they're they're the target for everybody just look how down in the knee they are as they go around the corner they're into the cross rolls staying down really using those outside edges through those rolls absolutely amazing and sometimes the speed doesn't come across as well on the tv but i think with these two especially with that coat flowing like that you can really get a feel of the the energy that they're putting into this paso doble Hope you're enjoying our continuing coverage of this Grand Prix series. This uh, trophy, Eric Bombard, the fourth of six of the Grand Prix. Remember the top six from all of the Grand Prix, the uh, top six point scorers in each category will go through to Seoul in the Republic of Korea for the Grand Prix final from December the 10th and 14th. And of course, we'll have that for you as well here on British Eurosport and Eurosport International. It's thrilling times for us as skating commentators and uh, from your emails we're sure for you at home don't forget if you want to give us your point of view the email address is skating.eurosport at yahoo.com skating.eurosport at yahoo.com if you've got thoughts for either chris and myself or for nikki slater will be joining us tomorrow that's fine 38.49 their season's best not far away from that 37.98 and it was over three clear marks better than anything else. Frederick Vaiella, Massimo Scali took second place, and Sinead and John Kerr 